We are walking up the hills. No, up a mountain. <laughs> Karen is tired already. <laughs> Look at her, she's tired. This is like the Babylonian wall. Yeah. Plead my cause, O oh Lord, with them that strive with me. Fight against them that fight. Yep, it is steep. Just about gone past halfway. Current still going. That is all the way up there. Sweaty he is oh my days we made it Well, because we went for a walk after breakfast and we forgot to take the keys with us and now everybody's out. The helpers have gone to the shop and just don't want to let us in. <laughs> I don't know, we just have to wait until they come back from the shop. Well, actually on our walk today, we saw a guy lugging a huge jackfruit around and um, he wanted to go and ask him to wake up the jackfruit from. Turns out, as we were walking past him the back, um, jackfruit is still very new to people here, so the guy was looking around the jackfruit and seemed like he was sharing it with some people and telling them what it is and how to eat it. So that was very interesting because now I want to go figure out where we can get our hands on jackfruit. But since it's new, I think you can probably get it. You just need to find a tree and just chop one down, isn't it? I did not chop down the tree, chop down the jackfruit. Just go on the one jackfruit. I didn't say that. I said stoned on the jackfruit. But if the jackfruit tree is just growing and it doesn't belong to anyone and you stone it down, you're not stealing it. <laughs> There's this guy who walks around. So there are people who walk around and they sell stuff. Um, I don't think there's anybody on the street at the minute to show you. But yeah, when they're selling stuff, 
um, they they walk down the street and they announce what they're selling. And there's this one guy who sells these little fish and they're called Indagara. And he goes, Indagara. <laughs> I think it's the coolest thing ever because he's got his unique selling point. Nobody can say it like him. <laughs> Shield and buckler, stand up for me. We just went to pick up something and now we're trying to get out of this little area that we came into to pick yeah, the things up following. and there's a kid following us apparently uh, and now <laughs> as we're going up we're gonna go up this little ramp here yes you guessed it where that bicycle came from we are going up here can't drive here if you bought your license. Well, people do. Apparently, people do. So, that's something interesting for you. You can take a motorbike taxi coming up. There you go. Or you can take a bicycle taxi. There you go. Is the craziest junction I've ever seen in all my life. No look at this, is. look at this, look at this. We are turning left, look at this. It's literally, you just go wherever there's a space that you might potentially fit. Look at this. People beeping their horns like crazy. With a gigantic gun. Yeah man. Just be where do I go? Just controlling traffic with a huge gun. It seems like something is happening somewhere over there yeah, that you can't really see. Person. Yeah, very important person. And we've no idea who. So now traffic has gone a wall. Well not a wall because you can't really go a wall because it's clearly here, but you know. These people a little still... bit crazy. And still, the, the, the taxi velo, taxi moto, taxi this, taxi that is still doing their thing. Madness.